So here we are at a, uh, a house in Phoenix, Arizona that we just sold, uh, Equity Sunrise, bank, that bank. And this house uh, is actually a decent little house, three bedroom, two bath, with a pool in the backyard. It just got a new roof put on by the insurance company. Um, this deal, this one actually, uh, we closed for a couple clients. Uh, the seller was a uh, uh, homeowner in foreclosure, and she actually uh, lived in this house for a while, but I met her, she was in foreclosure and uh, she needed some time, didn't have any money, didn't have a place to go, so discussed with her the option of doing a short sale instead of a foreclosure, and by doing that, we actually bought her several months to live in the house, save up her money to move, and uh, we kept the foreclosure off of her record. So uh, that's what we did for her, and then for the investor, we actually got this deal approved for him. Um, fair market value for this house, uh, probably around $45,000 as is, and uh, we got it approved at $35,000, so nice little deal for the investor. Um, looks like they're selling it uh, with creative financing, going to do a lease to own, like a lease option, lease purchase, rent to own type of deal, and uh, they'll make pretty good money. Um, he was actually talking about maybe just wholesaling this house, um, which you know most people probably refer to as a flip. We call it wholesaling. So he's probably not going to really do much other than just turn it really quick. Probably not actually put much sweat, sweat equity into it. Um, I was just coming out here today to grab the lockbox off of it now that it's sold, and I was actually a little bit disgusted in the way the seller, seller left the place. Um, you can't smell it in the video, obviously, but this place reeks. Um, but it's a pretty nice house. You can see tile floors, ceiling fans, whatnot. Um, I'll just give you a quick tour real quick. This is uh, bathroom number one, and uh, you'll see there. Now here's the two smaller bedrooms. It's got a ceiling fan, but uh, also got lots with, left with lots of remnants. Uh, <laughs> sure my investor is loving me right now for that. We got a little uh, storage there. Here's another bedroom, no ceiling fan in this one. And then uh, go here, you got the, the main room out front here, the ceiling fan, top floor again, and uh, walk on in here to the kitchen. Holy cow, this house comes with a baby. Whoa! No, just kidding. That's just JJ. That's my little junior. He's just at work with daddy today. Um, I feel bad that he's actually in this house right now because it smells so bad. Here's the kitchen. You know, nice cabinets, decent countertops, nice stove and dishwasher. They took the refrigerator here and uh, a little bit of work that's going to need to be done out here. But um, this would be the main eating area. you got the ceiling fan here and then off over here we have the master bedroom. I'm not sure if this... I think this might have been converted from a garage. The tax records actually showed this house at about 1,100 square feet. And the uh, owner said it was actually closer to 1,600. So that worked well um, with us getting, uh, getting it approved at a good price for the investor. Kind of, we use that to our advantage. You walk back here and there's a large walk-in closet. Actually wraps around. I don't know if you can see that very well. And then here's the master bathroom with a, a giant jacuzzi sized tub. Sorry the lights aren't better, the electricity is off. And, uh, Nice little vanity over here, and then you got your toilet in the back there. So off the master bedroom is the Arizona room, and uh, I think this was added on too as well, or you can get to it through where we just were a couple minutes ago. Slider into the Arizona room. This is also tile. Decent little uh, space for storage or, or whatever you want to do with it. Um, brick home, not sure if I mentioned that, but one of the things that kind of nice about the house. This house has got a pool. Ooh, I'm not sure that we want to go back to that pool. It's nasty. Last time I was here, the water was up much higher than that, and there was stuff swimming around in the pool all over the place. But now it looks just pretty empty. So anyways, um, it's a great deal for the, uh, for the seller, great deal for the investor, great deal for the bank. The bank actually saved money that they wouldn't have got had they foreclosed on the property, which is why they did the short sale. So, um, not sure what the investor's gonna actually do. He might um, flip it real quick for a wholesale deal, or he might put a, a tenant in here and make them homeowners. Um, but anyways, just wanted to, to give you an idea of what $35,000 can get you here in Phoenix. So if you wanna invest in the uh, Phoenix area, you need to call me, 623-252-3234. We can make it happen for you. And uh, we can show you a return that is just unheard of uh, in the stock market. So uh, anyways, uh, hope you liked and we'll talk to you soon.